All right, what's up guys? Uh, we're gonna dig into this new tenure business. I mean, this seems like the biggest kind of event related to the tenure uh, anniversary that I've seen. You know it's getting real when there is a separate inbox. We'll take a look at that in a second. Loading, 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 loading. We're just trying to check the events team. Hey, there we go. So we got Nat5 Selective Summon Event. Just pick one, first ever. It says right there, first ever. So pick a monster, get it. That's pretty great. As of right now, I would pick Hey Gang because that's the monster I want the most that I'm missing. Um, but I'm not going to pick it for 58 days because you only get to switch once and the odds I summon a Hey Gang in the next two months is not zero. It's not high, but it's not zero. So I'm going to wait. I think everyone should wait even though it's not fun. Um, I think that's probably the best bet to possibly get two things you really, really want. Um, we got Transmog Giveaways. I've not looked into this at all. Select a theme, select a monster, select an attribute. Cool, so you just get five transmogs. Pick your favorite five. I don't know what my favorite five are, so I will have to look into that. And you get a homunculus transmog for free. That's cool. Um, 100 by 100 scrolls. 100 plus 100, 10 year special scrolls. I have no idea what these scrolls do. I know they exist, and I assume they're good. In theory, I can click on them. Maybe not. Oh, wait. All right, let's see. Get up to 200 10-year special scrolls, then summon a monster of any attribute. So they're just attribute specific? Does that mean light, dark? Purchase scrolls, special runes, shiny scroll, special bonus. Uh, I don't know that I fully understand these. Summon a monster. Oh, okay. No, okay, no. They're... Summon a monster of any attribute. That means they can be light dark. That's all it means. So the rates are still the same. Okay, that's not as good as I was like, whoa, did we just get a bunch of... No, but you know, it's like uh, all attribute except mysticals. That's fine. That's definitely better than uh, normal, which we'll take that, right? Um, we've got the Sky Shop event, which is just collect coins, buy stuff. And then we've got the bonus spend 10 of either type, get an extra one, which is really cool. So basically... Get all your mysticals and your tenure scrolls during the window of the bonus summon and try to get stuff, right? So that is what's going on. Pretty cool, pretty cool. We've got the new monsters also, which I've not looked at at all, other than that there's a light 33 speed lead. Um, <clears throat> they're not as good as the seven year scrolls, I don't think, because you can pick your nat fives and hopefully get them. Um, my most wanted, I think, have remained unchanged. Let's just double check. Man, my, my summoners are slow. I can't even scroll. So, Hey Gang's my number one. I think Sonya's my number two. And maybe this blue guy's number three. And then I, the other ones I don't really want that much. So, I'm getting down to it where I kind of have most of the things I want, which is nice. Um, but And I'll get one more. And Hey Gang would be a great little feather in my cap for pretty much everything I want to do. So, let's do a little summons so we can kind of see how some of these events work. And we'll see if we get anything we want. Let's do our fires first. And I had a blessing, right? I'm pretty sure I did. The goal is to get the new four stars, uh, number one, and then get the new five stars. It would be great because they're new and you have a better chance to get them. I feel like getting them when you have the, up, the higher chance is the way to go because otherwise it's real hard. Are you new? You don't look new. Assassin. Our first four star, though. That's a good sign. You can't get anything until you get at least one four star. Let's summon a couple more water scrolls. So I don't have a ton of scrolls. I've been saving since the collab ended, um, but not since the rate up or the uh, the bonus scroll ended, which a lot of people did. So I kept summoning throughout the collab, even though there wasn't a bonus because I wanted the limited collab monsters. Um, so that left me with not a ton, but I mean, I've got like 130-ish and then I'm going to get the 200 from the event. So I'll be okay. And what's nice is they're letting everyone like get a crack at these monsters. Like everybody's getting 200 scrolls, which is enough to at least be like, well, I had a shot, you know? All right, so we've got 111 Mysticals. Let's go ahead and clear some storage because that's how we do it. For some reason, in my mind, it's less lucky to summon into a full storage. I know that's just, you know, not true, but that's that's what my mind has decided, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna question it. We can put Galleon away. What else can we put away? Let's put Galleon away. We'll do little sets of 30. That seems reasonable. So 100 scrolls, 50-50 chance of getting an at five. We've got a Blessing. Let's see what we get. What is this thing? Okay, some sort of scroll summoning bonusy thing. We like that. <clears throat> First set of 10. 
And we'll do another thing when we get a shot at the uh, the fancy, fancy scrolls, I think. It's worth a shot. Robos. It's weird to exist in a world of Summoner's War where four-star skill-ups like, kind of don't matter at all. Like, the game is like old enough, it's mature enough that there's no four-star really that I'm like, oh, good, I got one. Like, I think I've pretty much got everything I need that's four-star related. It's also weird for these summons to not have a special summon effect after doing the collab for so long before that. So, like, this could be one of the new monsters. It just looks like everything else. I mean, it's not, but it could be. There's a possibility. So we got double lightning in this pack. That's pretty good. Um, let's do one more pack of ten, and then we'll go put them into storage. Hey, lightning right away. That looks new. I don't recognize that thing. Cyborg. Cool. We'll go look at that cyborg. Hey, another one. Hey, a different element. Sweet. Now we just need the blue one. And we are cyborged up. This is clearly the 10 stack of cyborgs. Let's look at these new cyborgs. So, wind. Passive. Recovers your HP by 20%. If you gain a turn while having 50% or below HP, increases the damage by up to 75% according to your HP condition. Okay, so if you have more than 50%, you hit harder. If you have less than 50%, you gain a little bit of health. That's not a lot of health. A little bit of health. Taxi enemy, ignores damage reduction effects, cannot be revived. That's kind of cool. Decrease the defense on skill one. That's always good. And then we got the red one, which is here. Attacks all enemies, decrease the defense for two turns. Cannot be resisted if the attack power is less. Wow. Unresistible defense break. I like that a lot. Attacks all enemies, decrease their attack power for two turns. Absorbs the attack power of the enemies that have lower attack power than you. Okay, so... An attack power decrease with an absorb, and then the defense break. This is really nice because they I don't I don't think we have an AoE irresistible defense break. Like now I think some possibilities open up in uh arena offense and I guess siege, where you can break up the defense break and the attack up that used to be only um a galleon thing, you know? Like you did both and you hope the defense break broke or worked. So that's really nice. I like that a lot. Anything irresistible is great. So you do Tiana. <clears throat> you do that guy, and then you do something with the tack up, and it all happens. <laughs> like, that's pretty cool. Like, you could do one of those monsters that buffs its own attack up or buffs the group or something, you know? Like Kali or something like that. I don't know. There's some possibilities there. Uh oh, a couple dead packs in a row. We got our cyborgs, and the game said, all right, you're good. Yay, lightning. Ooh, new one. Be the other color. No, you're wind. That's fine. We'll get the blue one. What are you? Okay, no. But yeah, any of those cyborgs. I guess I just said I don't want any nat fours, but I guess that's wrong. I do want cyborgs now, because I have zero of them. We maxed out, yeah. So cyborg scallops matter again. Dump everybody into storage. So I'll be building the fire one. I don't see why the fire one isn't worth uh, isn't worth building. That seems pretty good. And we got 30 spots, and we got 31 scrolls. Symmetry. Whoa! That happened right away. Um, yeah, it doesn't matter. It's getting fed. So, got an at 5, which is really uh, lucky for the number of scrolls I had. It just popped so fast. I hit skip and it's just like, boom. See, now I don't have a blessing, though. If I happen to luck out and get a second at 5 in this pull, um, it's just I get what I get. I've had that happen once, which it's not likely enough for me to make me want to carry two uh, blessings, but... It was a bummer, because I'm all about getting all the monsters. Like, I know some people don't do it at all. See, I've got a ton of Splendid Blessing power. But my theory is, is that once I get everything, or I have enough Ancient Crystals to buy Blessings for every other summon, then I can start pouring them into LDs, which I think is the next best thing. Like, I feel like pouring them into LDs and not trying to get all the Nat 5s kind of limits your options in the game. And you're going to want all the Nat 5s anyway, right? Like, that's the thing you want, so might as well front loaded is my is my theory plus if i keep pulling dupes like i'm missing i guess now with the new ones maybe 20 ish monsters and so all i need to do is pull 20 ish dupes hey it's the one i didn't have i gotta pull like 20 ish dupes and then i have enough crystals to cover everything i might ever uh pull right all right so the blue one is passive your attacks won't land as glancing that's nice if the target you attack during your turn has lower attack power your skills harmful effect duration increases by one okay decrease attack power absorb attack bar so same thing and defense break. So this is won't glance, extra turn. This is a two turn, so that becomes a three turn defense break. This becomes a two, three turn attack power break. 
and you can't glance, so you can attack uh, wind and be okay. Not bad for a little uh, AoE monster, right? <clears throat> More likely to land it. Not too bad, not too bad. And we got all three, so goal number one accomplished. If we happen to pull one of the new Nat 5s, great. Um, but we got the Nat 4s, so that was the goal. We got it. And we'll get rid of that Rika here in a bit, but we're not in any rush. We got tons of crystal stuff. All right, we got one more here. And then we got five of these new things, but I think we have some goodies to collect, right? Like there's the... Let's see. Let's go collect some goodies and see what they give us. <clears throat> so collect all. So we got stuff. I don't know. A bunch of stuff. We'll go see what it is. And then we should have some goodies over here too, right? Yes. Goodies, goodies, goodies. See, to me, this little symbol, and I haven't looked at it, says that you get one of the cyborgs. Maybe you get to pick. Maybe not. I don't know. We did click it, right? Game. I mean, I get why it's lagging. Like, everybody's summoning, but... You know. There we go. <clears throat> okay. So we collect... I don't know why we got two of these. Oh, just use 50 scrolls, I see. Collect. Yes. Okay. And then we come down here. We get that. And this is just get a random one, which you might as well get it, because... Did that... Did that... Was that spelled right? I feel like it's had an S. Maybe I'm wrong. It just felt... Felt wrong. All right, so we got 23 days to summon an enhanced rate. So, basically, I'm summoning for 23 days, and uh, we'll see. Oh, I don't want to do that yet. Well, that just takes time. We don't need that. Let's see if we got any more goodies here. I think we do. No, we don't want those. Any more goodies? I know you can sort by, like... Oh, it's all probably on the new the new inbox. Yeah, that's where it is. Scrolls. Yep, take them all. And then up here, yeah, we can leave that. Okay, so just a little bit more, <clears throat> and we'll see what we get. So we'll do our mysticals first, because why not? Oh, 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 decisions. See, I don't think this red one's really new. I think that's the one I have the Frederica of. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure. It's weird it's the same picture when you... But not Frederica, the other the other version. So I need to go check, right? Because I really would like a Teor. But I think, I think I have that one. Gladiatrix. Let's go look. It says new, but it's sneaky. Oh, that's funny. I don't think I've ever done that. Put a Nat 5 on pause. Is this going to be another Nat 5? No, okay. Whew. Not that that's like a good thing to not get one. But I just talked about it. And then, man, I'm getting really lucky. All right, so... First things first, we're going to buy another Blessing, because we're going to need it. And then second thing, we're going to go see if I already got it. I'm 95% sure I already have that thing, just in the the other version. Yeah, it's this, right? Cassandra. Attack power up. Ares Laugh Breath. Invincible Life Drain. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the same thing. Invincible Life Drain. Let's go check. Let's see. No. But you're in this area. Are you a four-star? What's the deal? Oh, we got to go down to Unawakened. Attack power, invincible life drain. Yeah, so this is the same thing. It's sneaky that it says it's different, but it's uh, it's one I already have, which is great. Now I get a new Teor, which is one of the ones I wanted. It was on my little list, so we'll take a Teor. Teor has use. Welcome to the team, Teor. So a new monster. That's uh, That doesn't happen that often. We'll take that for sure. All right, so let's go ahead and finish up. Two nat fives and one new. That's crazy. Out of not even 200 scrolls. That's probably my my luck for the whole event, which is fine. I mean, that's, that's plenty. <clears throat> and I get a Hay Gang, right? At the very least. And I get a not Antares. So. Yeah, this is gonna be this is gonna be really good. So up here, let's let's do our couple of tenure scrolls, and then we'll do our legendary scroll and we'll see. So these can be uh, LD. Which, I assume the rates are normal? Like, I don't know if it's equally distributed amongst the five elements for three stars or what. Um, I guess it's we can find this out, right? Isn't there somewhere we can click on the rates? Is it here? No. I thought there was like a little button that appeared. I don't see it. Oh well, let's just go. Oh, you don't get to pick. You don't get to have an increased uh, summoning effect for the new stuff. That's interesting. 
All right, so we got seven of these. Let's just see how they go. Oh, light right away. Is that lucky or was that... I mean, not that it matters. It'd be nice to get a lightning though, wouldn't it? Not that seven gives us a chance, but... Oh, that was dark, I think. I just cl clicked right past it, but that was dark. So we got two light dark out of seven, so maybe it's just an equal distribution amongst the five. And then we got this one legendary, and then we'll go see if we have any more treats, and we'll go from there. <clears throat> lightning. Blade Master. Hello, sir. That, is that what he is? Blade Master? No, Anamusha. All right, so I think we might have more treats here. Oh, the little treat thing went away. Let's see. Oh, there it is. There it is. Collect all. What did we get this time? Did we get anything summonable? We got five more of those. We can do it. No, wait. Maybe we didn't get anything. Maybe we just got energy. Let's go see. So we got maybe one more mystical. Maybe two. We're also going to do to me summoners where is. That'll be fun. Go to the event. All right. Two more. Well, we got to summon them. We got to know what's in there. Whoa. Easy. So here. Here's our two. Let's see what's in them. One. And two. Hey! Harp. String. Harp. Same thing. It's all good. All right, so, did a bunch of stuff, got something good, it's a good day. Where's that Tayor? Hey, Tayor. So you are now part of the team. Can we wake you up? Oh yeah, we can. Time to wake up. I don't know where I'll use them. I've kind of gotten to the point of having a whole bunch of Nat 5s on deck, and like you can see them here, but like not having a clear vision for them, so they just kind of chill. Um, but you know, something will turn up. We'll figure it out, and maybe we'll get something neat out of the random LD things, which we'll definitely summon again as well. Like, even just a couple of the, like, critical four stars that I'm missing would be amazing. So, in terms of the status of the summons, go to my scroll. So, Taylor is one of my seven most wanted. That's pretty sweet, so we can remove him. We can kind of remove Haygang too, right? Because we're getting one of these two. So, if we pull either one, we'll just take the other one. So, I think we'll take Haygang out, because we've got... We've got him. Do I want this thing? What do these things do? We haven't looked at them yet. Defense. Remove beneficial effect every turn. 50% though. Every time the enemy gets a turn, the target's HP is reduced by 3%. See, that to me feels like TOA hell, right? Like, that feels very TOA hell to me. Does a bunch of stuff. Attacks four times. And the brand. I like the brand on one a lot. That's just kind of nice. Let's check the blue one. Crit rate. Remove all beneficial effects. Increase the cooldown cool down by two turns of the selected target. Whoa. What's the base speed? 99. Ah. Well, what about Awakened? 100. Okay. So, that's interesting. That's like budget Veronica, right? That's budget Veronica for, for the rest of us. For the, the poor people. Irresistible. With an Absorb. So, this is interesting because you have to build him with a ton of uh, accuracy to land Irresistible. And then any follow-ups always hit and become Neftis, which is kind of neat. Brand. I think the blue one might be the one I want. His name is Kid. That's hilarious. What's this one's name? Seven Rx. Seven Rx. Seven Rx. I should know. That's probably some name. I just don't know what it is. And then this one is Storm. Oh, I can go figure that one out. Seven Rx. All right. Attack power, big. Backup code. Offsets incoming damage that causes you to die. It reflects 100% of the damage to the target that attacked you. In addition, damage increases by 10% for every harmful effect granted on the target. Okay, so it's a damage boost and a one-turn don't die big reflect. That's nice. This is the do a bunch of stuff. And this is the brand. They seem okay. I mean, I don't know that they'll uh, like take the world by storm. All right, so what this one must be... Oh, that's kid. All right, let's see what's this one. Tricks. See, I can do. I can do things. That's tricks. All right. So I think I would probably put the blue one, right? Yeah. I think I put the blue one into my most wanted. Um, anybody else? Man, we're we're running out of water units here. That's crazy. And I've passed on Ariel like three times. We're really just running out of all the OG units. We're into like the new stuff. Is that where we are in Wind? Also, yeah, pretty much. I mean, I call this new stuff. I don't know. I don't really see a use for these guys in particular. So I think. I would probably put the new guys 
in there just because they're new. Maybe, yeah. I mean, he's not that good. I don't know. I don't really know what my next inclusion would be. I haven't really looked at the Twin Angels recently. Um, we'll just put Ariel because he's blue. And that'll put the entirety of water in my most wanted. That seems fun. So that's what it looks like now. So uh, thanks for watching and just listening to me ramble about upcoming summons. And I hope you guys get, you know, whatever you're looking for. You'll at least get one, which is pretty cool. Um, so yeah, thanks for, you know, watching the channel for the past 10-ish years or whatever it was. And uh, yeah, we'll catch you in the next video. Take care, y'all.